Hello and welcome to our video about the top 10 things to do in Krakow, one of the most beautiful and historic cities in Poland, known for its stunning architecture and vibrant cultural scene. Krakow's rich history and cultural significance make it one of Europe's most captivating cities. Make sure to watch until the end, as we saved the best thing to do in Krakow for last. Remember to like this video and subscribe to our channel for the best travel information about Europe. We use a mix of travel experience, a lot of local knowledge and reviews to provide you with the most reliable and relevant travel information in Europe. So be sure to visit our website for the biggest travel website about Europe. Krakow is located in the southern part of Poland, near the border with the Czech Republic and Slovakia. The city has a population of approximately 770,000 people, making it the second largest city in Poland after Warsaw. Krakow is home to numerous historic landmarks and attractions, and visitors can sample traditional Polish cuisine, shop for souvenirs, or simply soak up the atmosphere in one of the city's many cafes or bars. Krakow also has a thriving arts and music scene, with numerous museums, galleries and performance spaces showcasing the city's cultural heritage. The Museum of Contemporary Art in Krakow and the National Museum are must-visit destinations for art lovers, while the Krakow Philharmonic and the Julius Slovaki Theatre offer world-class performances. Krakow has a rich and fascinating history that spans over a thousand years. It was founded in the 7th century and became the capital of Poland in the 11th century. The city flourished during the Middle Ages, and many of its beautiful buildings and landmarks date back to this period, including the Wawel Castle and the main square. Krakow was also an important center of Jewish culture and religion, and the Jewish quarter of Kazimierz is a testament to this bygone era. Krakow played an important role in Polish history, serving as the site of many important political events, including the coronation of Polish kings. During World War II, the city was occupied by Nazi Germany and suffered greatly. However, it was largely spared from the destruction that ravaged other European cities, and many of its historic buildings and landmarks survived. Today, Krakow is a vibrant and cosmopolitan city that attracts visitors from around the world. Its rich history, beautiful architecture and vibrant cultural scene make it one of Europe's most fascinating and dynamic cities. Now, let's take a look at the top 10 things to do in this amazing city. Number 10. Visit the Jagiellonian University. Jagiellonian University is one of the oldest and most prestigious universities in Europe, located in the heart of Krakow, Poland. Founded in 1364 by King Casimir the Great, the university has a rich history and a distinguished academic reputation. Visitors to Krakow should definitely make time to visit the Jagiellonian University, which is not only an important academic institution, but also a beautiful and historic landmark in the city. The university campus is comprised of several different buildings, including the Collegium Maius, the oldest building of the university, which houses a museum showcasing the history of the university and the city of Krakow. The museum includes exhibits of scientific instruments, ancient maps and rare books, including works by Copernicus and the Gutenberg Bible. In addition to the buildings and museums, visitors can also explore the university's botanical garden which features a wide variety of plants and flowers from around the world, as well as a small pond and several sculptures. Visiting the Jagiellonian University is a unique opportunity to explore an historic and important academic institution, while also experiencing the beauty and culture of Krakow. The university has produced many notable alumni, including Pope John Paul II, and its impact can still be felt today in the intellectual and cultural life of the city. Number 9. Try traditional Polish cuisine. Polish cuisine is hearty, flavorful and reflects the country's diverse cultural influences. Krakow, in particular, is known for its delicious traditional dishes that are sure to satisfy any foodie's cravings. A food tour in Krakow is the perfect way to explore the city's culinary offerings and learn about the history and culture behind each dish. A typical food tour might include stops at local markets, bakeries and restaurants where you can sample a variety of traditional Polish foods. Some must-try dishes include pierogi, which are savoury dumplings filled with meat, cheese or potatoes and served with butter and onions. 
Another popular dish is bigos, a hearty stew made with sauerkraut, meat and vegetables. Other favourites include kielbasa, Polish sausage, waskipek, smoked cheese and barts, beet soup. Polish cuisine is also known for its delicious pastries and desserts, including pakski, which are Polish donuts, babka, that's marble cake, and sarlotka, which is apple pie. One of the best things about going on a food tour in Krakow is the opportunity to learn about the history and cultural significance of each dish. For example, pierogi are a traditional dish that's been enjoyed in Poland for centuries, and each region of the country has its own unique variation. Bigos is a dish that dates back to the Middle Ages and was once served to Polish royalty. In addition to tasting delicious food, a food tour is a great way to explore the city and meet locals who are passionate about their culinary heritage. You'll get an inside look at Krakow's food scene and discover hidden gems that you might not have found on your own. Number 8. Take a stroll along the Vistula River. Walking along the river, you'll pass by several of Krakow's iconic landmarks, including the Basilica of St. Michael, the Archangel, the historic Kazimierz district and the Bernatek footbridge. The footbridge is a popular spot for locals and tourists alike, offering stunning views of the river and the city skyline. A stroll along the Vistula River is also a great way to experience Krakow's vibrant culture and lively atmosphere. Number 7. Explore St. Florian's Gate St. Florian's Gate is one of the most iconic landmarks in Krakow and is a must-visit destination for anyone interested in the city's history and architecture. Built in the 14th century, the gate is the only remaining structure of the original city walls and serves as a symbol of Krakow's medieval past. The gate features two towers and a beautiful Gothic facade, complete with ornate decorations and sculptures. Visitors can climb to the top of the gate for stunning views of the surrounding area, including the historic Old Town and the beautiful Barbican Fortress. St. Florian's Gate is also an important cultural landmark in Krakow, serving as a venue for concerts, exhibitions and other cultural events throughout the year. In fact, the annual St. John's Fair, one of the city's largest festivals, is held just outside the gate and draws thousands of visitors from around the world. For history buffs, St. Florian's Gate offers a fascinating glimpse into Krakow's past, when the city was a bustling hub of commerce and culture. The gate was once the main entrance to the city, and visitors can still see the grooves in the pavement where the wooden gates once stood. Number 6. Visit Schindler's Factory Museum Schindler's Factory Museum is a must-visit destination for anyone interested in the history of World War II and the Holocaust. The museum is located in the former enamelware factory owned by Oskar Schindler, the German businessman who famously saved the lives of more than 1,000 Jewish workers during the war. The museum tells the story of Krakow under Nazi occupation and features a variety of exhibits and multimedia displays that bring this tumultuous period of history to life. Visitors can explore recreated street scenes from the city, view authentic artefacts and documents from the period and learn about the lives of the Jewish workers who were employed in Schindler's factory. One of the most moving exhibits in the museum is the room dedicated to the Jewish ghetto in Krakow, which features a replica of a typical ghetto apartment and provides a powerful window into the harsh realities faced by Jewish families during this time. Visitors to Schindler's Factory Museum can also take part in guided tours, which offer a more in-depth look at the history and significance of the museum. These tours are led by knowledgeable guides who can provide additional context and insight into the exhibits and displays. Schindler's Factory Museum is an essential destination for anyone visiting Krakow. Through its exhibits and displays, the museum provides a moving tribute to the victims of the Holocaust, while also celebrating the courage and humanity of those who worked to save lives during this dark period of history. Number 5. Take a tour of the salt mines. A visit to the Velikska salt mine, located just outside of Krakow, is a unique and fascinating experience that offers visitors a glimpse into the history of salt mining in Poland. The salt mine has been in operation for over 700 years and is now a UNESCO World Heritage Site. 
Visitors to the salt mines can take a guided tour that leads them deep underground through a network of tunnels and caverns that were carved out of the rock by hand over centuries. Along the way, visitors can view stunning underground lakes, intricate salt sculptures and even a fully functioning chapel carved entirely out of salt. One of the most fascinating aspects of the salt mine tour is learning about the history of salt mining in Poland, which played a crucial role in the country's economy for many centuries. Visitors can see firsthand the tools and techniques used by miners over the centuries and can even try their hand at some of the traditional methods of salt extraction. But the Salt Mines Tour is more than just a history lesson, it's also an immersive sensory experience. Visitors can taste the salty air, which is believed to have therapeutic properties, and can even take a ride down a long slide that leads deeper into the mine. A tour of the Walikska Salt Mine is an unforgettable experience that offers visitors a unique perspective on the history and culture of Poland. It's a chance to explore a hidden world deep beneath the Earth's surface, and to learn about the vital role that salt mining has played in shaping the country's history and economy. Whether you're a history buff, a lover of underground adventures, or simply curious about the world around you, a visit to the salt mines is not to be missed. Number 4. Admire the stained glass windows of St. Francis' Basilica. St. Francis's Basilica, located in the heart of Krakow, is one of the city's most iconic and beloved landmarks. The Basilica was built in the 13th century and has since undergone several renovations and additions, resulting in a stunning blend of architectural styles that reflect its rich history. One of the main draws of St. Francis Basilica is its exquisite interior, which is filled with stunning works of art and intricate decorative details. The Basilica's most famous feature is undoubtedly its stunning stained glass windows, which were designed by the renowned Polish artist Stanislaw Wyspiansky. These windows are widely considered to be some of the most beautiful and striking examples of modern stained glass art in the world and are a must-see for any visitor to Krakow. Another highlight of St. Francis Basilica is the elaborate and ornate decoration that covers nearly every surface of the interior. From the intricate carvings on the wooden pews to the stunning frescoes that adorn the ceiling, every inch of the basilica is a feast for the eyes. Visitors can also admire the basilica's many statues and sculptures, which range from delicate and lifelike to abstract and striking. Number 3. Wander through the historic Jewish Quarter. The historic Jewish Quarter, known as Kazimierz, is one of the most vibrant and fascinating neighborhoods in Krakow. This area is rich in history and culture and is a must-visit destination for anyone interested in learning about Jewish life in Krakow. Kazimierz has a long and complex history that dates back to the 14th century. Over the centuries, the area has been home to a vibrant Jewish community and its streets and buildings are filled with reminders of this rich cultural heritage. Visitors to Kazimierz can explore the area's historic synagogues, including the Old Synagogue, which dates back to the 15th century and is the oldest surviving synagogue in Poland. In addition to its historic sites, Kazimierz is also known for its lively atmosphere and thriving arts scene. The neighborhood is home to a wide variety of galleries, cafes and restaurants, many of which showcase the work of local artists and musicians. Visitors can sample traditional Jewish foods, listen to live music and enjoy the vibrant street life that makes Kazimierz such a special place. Number 2. Explore the Main Square The Main Square, also known as Reinek Glovny, is the heart of Krakow's Old Town and one of the largest medieval town squares in Europe. It dates back to the 13th century and is surrounded by colorful buildings, shops, cafes and restaurants. One of the main attractions in the main square is the Cloth Hall, which was once a centre of international trade and now houses shops selling traditional Polish crafts and souvenirs. The hall was originally built in the 14th century, but was later reconstructed in the Renaissance style. The Town Hall Tower is another prominent feature of the main square. It was once part of a larger Town Hall complex, but is now the only remaining part of it. Visitors can climb to the top of the tower for panoramic views of the city. The main square is also home to two historic churches, St. Mary's Basilica and St. Adalbert's Church. St. Mary's Basilica is known for its impressive Gothic architecture and stunning interior, including a famous altarpiece carved by Veit Stoss. 
St. Adalbert's Church, on the other hand, is the oldest church in Krakow and is known for its Romanesque architecture and ornate interior. Throughout the year, the main square is also the site of numerous events and festivals, including the annual Christmas market and New Year's Eve celebrations. The square is also a popular spot for street performers, musicians and artists, adding to its lively atmosphere. In addition to its historical and cultural significance, the main square is simply a beautiful and vibrant place to visit. It's a great spot to relax with a coffee or a meal while taking in the sights and sounds of the city. Overall, a visit to Krakow is incomplete without spending time in the main square. Number 1. Visit Wawel Castle The best thing to do in Krakow is to visit Wawel Castle, which is an architectural wonder and one of the most important historical sites in Poland. Located on a hill overlooking the Vistula River, the castle dates back to the 14th century and has played a vital role in Poland's history. It's been the residence of Polish kings and queens and now houses some of the country's most important art collections. The castle complex consists of several buildings, including the Royal Palace, the Wawel Cathedral and the defensive walls and towers. The palace was built in Renaissance style in the 16th century and features magnificent chambers, halls and galleries, including the Grand Royal Chambers, the Senate Hall and the Ballroom. The Wawel Cathedral is one of the most important churches in Poland and has been the coronation site of Polish kings and queens since the 14th century. The cathedral's interior is breathtaking, with intricate chapels, vaulted ceilings and stunning works of art, including the famous altarpiece by Wiet Stoss. The castle's defensive walls and towers are also worth exploring, and visitors can enjoy stunning views of Krakow from the top of the walls. In addition, the castle houses several museums, including the Royal Armoury, which features a fascinating collection of medieval armour and weapons, and the Treasury, which displays priceless royal jewels and artefacts. Visitors to Wawel Castle can also enjoy the picturesque courtyard, gardens and terraces, which offer a peaceful escape from the bustling city below. The castle's grandeur and beauty are a testament to Poland's rich cultural heritage and its significance in the country's history cannot be overstated. Whether you're an art lover, a history buff or simply looking for a stunning place to explore, Wawel Castle is sure to leave a lasting impression. That's the end of our video of the top 10 things to do in Krakow. Check out more amazing videos on our YouTube channel or visit our website to find the best travel deals to Europe. See you next time!